Hi everyone, welcome to JVN Testing Tutorials. So today's class will see about project explanation. So first step, so manual testing live project. So if you want to start a manual testing live project, we need to follow these steps, right? One to eight steps that is project introduction, understanding the functionality of the test plan, writing test cases, writing test plan, environment setup, test execution, bug reporting and tracking and last test sign off, right? One to eight steps we need to follow. So let's go into the move into the first step that is project introduction. See here project name. So what is the project name? Orange HRM. Orange HRM is a project name. Orange HRM application. I will show you now the application. See here. This is the application. Orange HRM project. This is Orange HRM. HRM means Human Resource Management. So it contains lot of modules. So I'm going to discuss what are the main functionalities of this application and about modules and sub modules are available in this application. Okay. So this is an open source application. Open, open source means everyone can use this application. There is no license for this application. Open source. Open source means free application. Everyone can access this application. There is no license for this application. So this project is related to human resource management, HRM. So what will use this application? Who will use this application means HR candidates. Who will use this application? HR candidates will use this application. See, in every organization, there will be HRs, right? From small companies to big MNCs companies, mid-level companies, startup companies also we have a HR team, right? In every organization, there will be a HR team, right? So that, so that HR team will work on this application. So let's see the project overview. It is a human resources management, HRM application. HRM means human resources management. So I will tell you how they will use, what is the use of this application and what are the functionalities we have. And this application is developed on PHP, MySQL database and Apache HHP. HTTP server. Okay. How they will develop this application? By using PHP, MySQL database, and Apache HTTP servers. And this application can be used in Linux environments and Microsoft Windows environments also. So, this application, this Orange HRM application project can be used in Linux environment systems and Windows environment systems also. So let's see now what are the functionalities this applications provides to the HR people. Okay. So this application contains two modules. This application contains two modules. One is HRM admin module and another one is ESS user employee self service ESS what is the meaning of ESS what is the abbreviation of ESS employee e for employee ES yes for self and another S for service got it so this project contains two modules one is HRM admin module and another one is ESS user module so HRM admin module is a main HR, uh, HR admins, main admin module, this one is a main. In this project, HRM admin module is a main thing, okay. HR admins will use, means HR team will use this admin module. Whatever the HR team will be there in the organization, right? In all the companies, you can take, 
take in IT sector, you can take in a non-IT sector and you can take in a pharmaceutical sector, in a, in a insurance sector, healthcare sector, you can take any sector. In all sector, the HRs will be there in every organization, right? So that HR candidates will use this admin module, HRM admin module. What the HR team will do this in this admin module means? Suppose, see here, a new employee is joined in that company. So, what the HR will do? So, HR uh, will add the employees to the portal. Right. HR team will list out the employees, listing employees. And they can also add the new employees and they can also configure the leaves in the portal they can create the time sheets for all the employees in the organization right they will create the they can create the time sheets also for all the employees time sheets means uh, login time how much time we are uh, employees are using uh, used to log in for daily four hours or eight hours something like that time sheets so and next employee should able to fill the time uh, time sheets like login hours how much time did the employees work daily like this and the requirement uh, recruitment part also suppose a new employee is joined so employee will provide educational documents right educational certifications previous relieving letter previous offer letter other card pan card they do some process right like induction process so all these stuffs comes under recruitment process right yes that also will handle by the hr admin people next and performance of employees also like so uh, like every year the employees will get bonus right bonus and hike something based upon their performance right so the performance rating is managed by hr in admin module right so this also this performance module also will be managed by hr in admin module so this all uh, listing uh, listing the employees adding the employees configure leads time sheets recruitment and the performance of employees this all uh, used by the hr team administrator got it So, this HRM admin module will be accessed by HR admin people only. So, what? So, as an employee, can we do this administration work as a normal employee, as a working employee, not HR employee? As a normal employee, can we uh, do this administration work like listing the employees, adding the employees, configure leaves, timesheet, recruitment? and uh, performance of employees can we do this administration work no right so for an employees another module is there that is ess user module got it in this application two modules is there one is hrm admin module and another one is ess user module got it ESS means employees employee self service. This is the one more module in the Orange HRM project. So, in this ESS module, as an employee, he or she can apply for the leaves, entitle the existing leaves, and employees can fill the timesheets, and also employees can update personal details in the My Info module. Got it? And employees can track the performance also, like rating, how much hike, is, hike in salary, everything. Employees can access this ESS module. Each individual employee can access this ESS module. They can find their own information, but they cannot find other employees' details for the normal employee their own information only they can 
add and they can see they can access the own information got it but they cannot find other employee details in this module but coming to admin module hr can access everything and hr team will see all the data whatever you have done in the ess module suppose i am entering my personal details like my name my father name my gender my date of birth my address my permanent address present address like that my location everything i am entering the in the ess ess user module so only my own data will be visible to me other person details are not visible to me i am the one employee and my friend uh, think like that another guy is also there he is my friend so he is also entering in uh, his own data like his mother name his father name his name his address his date of birth everything okay he can see their own data me can see my own data right i cannot see my friend data right and my friend cannot see my data but who is having access to see my data hr team hr admin team can access everything hr team hr team will see all data what you have entered got it so these are the main two high level modules available in this application or in hrm project one is hrm and one is ess user so now see in detail it is divided uh, so see here as i said it is divided into two different modules right one is hrm module admin module and second one is ess user ess means employee self service module right so in hrm admin module is completely product based hrm admin module is a completely product based because this product can be used by any organization this prod product can be used by every organization can be, can be used by any organization means suppose for example every organization having hr team right every organization having hr team and employees right so this is a particular product can be used for any kind of company so all the companies will use this kind of product hr team will use especially this project uh, this product is designed for market requirement not for specific customer so this product is designed for market requirement not for specific customer so that's the reason we call this is product as we have as we have seen in the manual theory uh, sessions right starting classes what is product based applications and what is project based application in the first class itself in the day one class itself i have explained about this product based applications and project based applications can you repeat once more what is project based and uh, product based see so project is something which we develop only for specific customer that is called project right and coming to product is something which is developed for multiple customers right so this is product we have two modules one is hrm admin module and another one is ess user module ess means employee self service module so hrm admin module is used by this hrm admin module is used by hr team and these are the sub modules this listing employees adding employees configure leaves time sheets recruitment and performance of employees these all are called sub modules 
this is the main module hrm admin module for this hrm admin module these are called sub modules is divided into sub modules again these sub modules are also divided into internally a lot of sub modules but this is the main this is the main hrm admin module and this is a sub modules okay now now come to ess user module this module can be accessed by employees individually this ess user module can be accessed by employees individually see individual uh, employees individual employees who are working in company can access this ess module so as an employee submitting the time sheets applying for the leaves tracking uh, tracking of the performance and updating the personal details in the my info so this activities this whatever the activities is there right applying the leaves filling the time sheets maintaining personal uh, details and uh, performance tracking so these are the activities can be accessed by all the employees who are working in that company so yes this is about ess user module so these are the two high level modules that is hrm admin module and ess user module in the hrm in the hrm admin module these are the sub modules in the ess user module these are the sub modules got it is understand everyone yes so going forward uh, going for the classes we are working on this ess user module so going for the classes real time whatever the real time work is there practically work how to write the test cases how to write the scenarios how to execute the test cases how to find the defects in that application so everything everything i will uh, i am going to show you in the practical so be concentrate from now onwards the practical classes are going to start so you have to involved more in these topics practically got it so this is the first step in the project so this is the first step in the project introduction this is the project introduction got it yes thank you hope you like this video please subscribe to youtube channel and share to your friends bye bye